Proper maintenance for Trilectronics GT or GXO series tester probes. Maintenance for GT and GXO series testers from Trilectronics is very easy but extremely important. In this short video, we will show you what needs to be done for flawless testing operation. Here we have the gel tube that you will insert into the probe. There is a plastic cap on the nozzle of the tube which needs to be removed before the gel tube is inserted into the sensor probe. Please do not discard the cap as it will be needed for proper gel tube storage. Unscrew the rotating cap at the top of the sensor probe to open the probe for refill insertion. After removing the plastic cap from the tube nozzle, insert the tube into the sensor probe so the nozzle of the tube faces down and the stem faces up. Place the rotating cap ensuring that the gel refill stem is going into the slot on the rotating cap. Use tester as per tester's manual. It is very important that at the end of the day or whenever you have completed testing that you remove the gel tube, recap it, and clean all the gel that is left over in the probe. Cleaning the probe. Remove the nose cap, the rotary twist cap, the gel cartridge from the body of the sensor assembly, and manually clean the nozzle tip opening with the plastic probe included with the tester. Place 5 to 6 drops of sensor cleaning solution on the back side of the sensor with the included dropper. Let the solution stay inside of the body of the sensor for 2 to 5 minutes. Blow it through with low pressure compressed air or with low pressure steam from the back side of the sensor. Insert the plastic cleaner probe into the nozzle opening to force any loosened gel from the opening and shake out any remaining gel. You should be able to see a light coming through the nozzle opening. Otherwise, repeat the cleaning procedure. If you use the machine infrequently, it is recommended to take the gel tube out of the sensor after each day of use. Store it in a room temperature environment or in a refrigerator inside two sealed bags. After this, clean the sensor according to instructions given. Please be careful not to damage the metal ring insert embedded inside the tip of the sensor probe. Do not use sharp or hard objects to clean the sensor probe. You can also use a jewelry steam cleaner to clean the probe for better results. When you are ready to use your tester again, you need to remove and save the tube cap. Insert the gel tube and the tester is ready. This way the gel will not dry and clog the tube and you will have your probe working for years to come.